Nepal is a small country. It makes up an adventure tourism for what it cannot make in the economic battle with its two neighboring giants, India and China. The recent earthquake has shook the nation and its people. Many places are still inaccessible, however, many others have survived the devastation. The most popular Everest Base Camp Trail seems to have suffered least from the incident, and many adventurers have recently completed the difficult trek, despite the worry and discouragements from the international community. Here is what William from Perth, Australia has to say about his recent trek to Everest Base Camp. I'm William White. I'm from Perth, West Australia, but I'm originally Scottish, and we have just uh, returned from uh, Base Camp. Now, base Camp was a very interesting uh, place to go. It is passable. Uh, we met a, a, a young doctor, Rachel, who had the, the quickest walk I ever came across coming down. And she told us that Base Camp is accessible except for a small uh, space and time, uh, but it was still accessible. And that's the most important thing. Mm -hmm. uh, it was from Luklav, we proceeded up the, the valley, if I can call it that. Uh, it was beautiful, uh, but it was a bit uh, disastrous uh, uh, as far as buildings go. Uh, th there is plenty of uh, stopover places uh, for uh, remedial things, uh, water, uh, food. Uh, the accommodation was limited in some uh, places because of uh, uh, the post -air earthquake situation, but there, there was plenty of uh, uh, accommodation in, in the meantime. Uh, the, uh, the scenery was beautiful, there's just one word for it. The population, the, the way that they, they live is simple, and it's well worth uh, seeing uh, how hard they work here. Uh, I found the trek very challenging, very challenging, uh, but it was worthwhile. And the experience of the Nepal country and the mountains is, well, beautiful. The, the, the routes, in my opinion, is uh, very safe, but you've got to remember it's mountainous country, but it's still passable, and you don't come here to be frightened from the country. You've got to enjoy the country. The country is there to be enjoyed. Uh, the, the, the crossing of the bridges uh, is, uh, in some cases, spectacular. Because I never knew that there the was spans uh, uh, the size of 100 metres. And I was a wee bit concerned at, at the uh, uh, Sir Edmund Hillary Bridge. And there's been a new bridge built above it but it's very passable indeed. I was a wee bit concerned, but when I seen the tour guide walk over it, I said, bugger it, and that's for me. And I grabbed it with both hands, and uh, we proceeded on up, up the, the valley to uh, Everest Base Camp. Uh, well, certainly it was restricted at present, because there is not the visitation, if I can call it that, uh, it's happening. People, uh, I never had any problems uh, as far as accommodation goes. Mm -hmm. it was, uh, there was very few people there for a start, but uh, the accommodation is there, and it, it's just actually waiting for the, the, the return of the, the, the tourist. Uh, and I think it's well worthwhile mm -hmm. the effort uh, and the, the scenery uh, up there. You're, uh, you've just got a, a lovely country. It's very, very seldom you'll ever get a chance to see this unless you come here and uh, enjoy it. Not at all. I was never worried. Mm -hmm. I'm not easily worried. Well, you've, you've got to come here with an open mind. Uh, I, I came uh, with an open mind, and I was ready to I was ready to take whatever came, and uh, I think uh, it's time people returned here. People are trying to rebuild, 
there's a lot of international help coming uh, to this country and it needs more help, i.e. Uh, the, the tourists returning uh, and feeling safe and that's, that's the main thing. But the bottom line is you will enjoy the countryside. Uh, the passage, there was no obstacles uh, for us to pass up through uh, to Mount Everest base camp. Uh, and the only uh, comment I can add was that Dr. Rachel, uh, his comment, and this was uh, before uh, La Bouche. Yeah, La uh, She says Everest base camp is accessible except for a small part, but she emphasized it's still possible. And it was still possible.